Well, this developing story has a lot of parents on alert tonight. A child walking near two schools and a library pulled into the bushes and sexually assaulted. Channel 2 reporter Roseanne Aragon live in Laporte where police are now warning parents to be vigilant. Roseanne? That's right, police have since increased patrol in this area. And parents say here, I spoke with a woman who has a fifth grader who goes to an elementary school just across the street. She says this news has gotten her shaken up. I'm scared for my child. I'm scared for, you know, all the parents, all the kids. Maria Gomez lives just down the street from where police say a minor was sexually assaulted. Something like this touches us all. Everybody watching this has to imagine that this might be their sister, their cousin, their friend. Investigators say Sunday a girl was walking alone down South Broadway outside this library when a stranger in a black tank top and white boxers grabbed her, pulled her into the bushes and sexually assaulted her. A suspect is actually described as a white male, um, approximately 20 to 30 years old. He has uh, short dark hair and tattoos as well. The victim told police the perpetrator had a numerical tattoo on his right wrist and a tattoo of a woman on his upper chest near his shoulder. He also had facial stubble. It happened just across from these tennis courts next to Laporte Junior High and elementary schools. The district called all parents this afternoon. I appreciate them calling me. Laporte ISD says it doesn't know who the minor is, but still sent home a letter to parents, helping police in their search for the suspect. A child should never be alone. Predators aren't going to prey on a group. They're going to prey on individuals. And that's what happened in this case, unfortunately. I hope they catch whoever it is right away. Now we're here on E Street. Police say that the suspects took off west on F Street. They're working with other agencies on a potential sketch. They're asking anyone with information to give them a call. Reporting live in Laporte, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Roseanne.